Yo, what's good? What's going on? Which is your girl Simba, and it's time for another reaction. Okay, shout out Nukes Top Five. Okay, we finished to react to one of their videos. It is. I'm saying it's Terror Tuesday over here on Twitch, where every Tuesday we get together, we watch some scary stuff. You know what I'm saying? If you ever want to be a part of that, this is where you need to be. Oh, wait, oh. Thought I'm almost instant intro? No, I did it. But yeah, it's Terror Tuesday over here on Twitch. If you ever want to watch scary stuff with us, you know what I'm saying, play some scary games with us, this is where you need to be every Tuesday over here on the Twitch. That's where we get a lot of stuff done. And then after you do that, show some love to this video you're currently watching. I greatly appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Also, if you're new, subscribe, notifications, all that good stuff. But yeah, shout out Nukes Top 5. This is Top scary, top 5 Scary Ghost Videos That Will Ruin Your Sleep. Chad, I hope y'all not ready. I hope y'all ready to not sleep tonight. Just so you know. You know? Just hope you know that you're not sleeping tonight. Alright, let's get it. Top five ghosts caught on camera dancing with the dead. 11 years ago, Tony Noguera recorded a short video of his son Elijah dancing to a Green Day song that was playing on their TV. Okay. He uploaded the video to his YouTube channel, and for years the video went mostly unnoticed. That is, until Tony's footage was shared on Reddit and hundreds of Reddit users agreed on one thing. There's something truly bizarre going on in this video. What? Dan. Dan, look at Elijah, go like this. Elijah, hey, like this. Elijah, look it. Hey. What Elijah, the like fuck? This. Wait, did y'all see that? We you dancing to uh some Did y'all see that? Did y'all see the kid? Oh Green my. Day? Dance, go. Did you see it? There was, a, there was a kid back there that was not back there uh, again when he turned around. Right behind Bruh. little Elijah, what looks like the dark shadowy figure of a child can Bruh. be seen. Just kind of standing there watching Watch the family. It. A few seconds later, and it's the child gone. disappears. It's gone. Even oh. creepier, right after the small shadowy figure is seen, a strange unexplained childlike giggle can be heard. Elijah, go like this. Now, I reached out to Tony Noguera personally, and he says that he has no idea who or what this unexplained figure might be. But he says his house does have a very creepy history. Tony's house is inside a gated community in Reno, Nevada, and the property on which the neighborhood was built used to be an old graveyard back in the 1960s. So could this creepy apparition be the ghost of a child buried Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way. I would never, bro. That's why you need to disclose that type of information before you move somewhere. There's just no way I'm living on top of a graveyard. There are dead people under here. Oh, hell no, bro. No. Oh, no. Read on the community grounds long ago. Let me know what you think Fuck down no. in the comments. Really haunted. Lee from the YouTube channel Really Haunted says that his house in England is a hot spot for strange paranormal activity. For over two years, Lee and his family have witnessed and captured terrifying events caught on static cameras that are set up throughout their home. 
Now, if you're a longtime Nuke Stop 5 viewer, you've probably seen some of Lee's scary poltergeist moments in my videos. And well, things have only gotten what the worse. Fuck? Late one night, Lee is fast asleep in bed when oh, his hallway no. and bedroom static cameras capture something downright oh, no. chilling. I'm sorry, but there's just no way. Yo, I'm telling you, animals and babies always know what's up. Animals, babies are always on point. But listen, you got one time to show me that you don't want me living here and I'm gone. Simple as that. All you got to do is show me one time. Oh, I'm invading your, this is your space. This is your area. Okay, I'm gone. I'm leaving. I won't come back. I will leave for you. No. For what? You think, no, 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 I'm not living in nobody's house where nobody goes. Especially that's moving furniture and throwing shit and popping up on night vision cameras. I'm good off you. You, you real demonic. You real like you got some demon vibes that I'm not fucking with. You know what I'm saying? It's giving demon. You know what I'm saying? I'm not I'm not on that type of time. You got it, Chief. I promise you, you do. I promise you, you do. Oh, fuck! See? Fuck that. No. No. Chat, look at me. Fuck no. Hell no. What the fuck was that? Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. I'm gone. I will leave. I, bro, you don't have to tell me twice. You don't have to tell me twice. Fuck that. Boy, I'm gone. Boy, I'm gone. Boy, I'm gone. Boy, I'm gone. I'm gone, bro. I'm gone. I'm out. gone I'm not living no I'm not living in nobody's house with nobody's ghosts you successfully ran me out of you got it bro you got it hell no and this nigga just went back to sleep the shadow figure seems to slowly rise from the floor in the hallway and then inexplicably zooms upwards into the ceiling Lee says that That's whatever this strange shape was, That's not no it ghost. actually That's knocked a open the attic demon. door. The sounds you hear in the video are the attic door being violently pushed open and then just moved around. Then later, we cut to Lee's bedroom, and now that whatever is, is in the attic seems to be moving Lee's overhead lamp around. But things get even weirder. Because a few days later, Lee's wife Stacy is home and fast asleep in bed when she experiences something absolutely terrifying so you got a wife that you're you're how are both so not not only is it one person that's okay both of y'all are okay with this this nigga is running through your house like the tomb raider right now that is this nigga's home that's where he re that's where he reside that's where that demon reside y'all cool with that Ain't no way. So he kind of thick. Boy, get the fuck out of here. Why he tooted him? <laughs> Nigga got a wedgie chest. <laughs> Yo. Watch it snatch the covers or some shit. Hey, chat. If that shit Yaga her hair and like pull the fuck out. <laughs> Imagine that shit pull the fuck out of her hair because it's in a ponytail and just drag her around the house. Yaga. <laughs> <laughs> hey, beat her ass, bro. Let him know that's not your spot, bro. Yup, see, yup, see, yup. Hey, <laughs> chat. When I tell you, bro, when I tell you, bro, that shit, y'all get the that shit say, boo, bitch. <laughs> that 
That shit said boo, bitch. <laughs> Yago. Did you see it? <laughs> now this one is a little hard to catch, but when the footage is sped up, you can clearly see another unexplained shadowy mass slowly floating oh. towards Stacy before it violently yanks her Yago. hair. And then that Surprisingly, shit, hey, that the shit dips off. incident didn't wake her, and Stacy says she doesn't remember any of it. After viewing the footage, the Boy, couple was understandably no pretty freaked out. Lee says that this is the most terrifying footage that he has ever caught. So it move, seems nigga. That whatever is haunting his home is becoming more and more violent and aggressive. Move, nigga. I highly recommend that you check out all of Lee's paranormal experiences over on his YouTube channel, Really Haunted. If you see a video that you think move, would be perfect nigga. for the top five, or if you have a ghost hunting channel and you caught something great, contact me at nukestop5 at gmail.com. The things in the woods. Hey, 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 I'm gonna stop you right there, big fella. I'm gonna stop you right there, big fella. What do I tell y'all, chat? We do not stay out the drawers. We don't go in them damn drawers. No drawers. We do not. We do not go in the fucking drawers. We don't do it. Stay out the drawers. Stay out the drawers. Stay out the drawers. Simple. That's all I'm saying. I I don't want to hear it. Listen, if you in the drawers, when some shit go down, you deserved it. Because why are you in there? Why is you in there? Why is you in the woods in the first place? So anything that happens to you while you there, that's on you. Because what we tell you, stay out the woods. This next mysterious video was sent to the popular Japanese YouTube channel, Fourth Wall. They explained that there was no extra information attached to the email in which the video file was shared. They tried reaching out to the sender, but they got no reply back. In the video, a man appears to be walking through the woods, seemingly looking for someone. What happens next is absolutely horrifying. Something, something gonna jump scare me, and I'm just not mentally prepared for that. You know, I just, I'm not. I, it's the fucking woods. It's the woods. Oh my god. I know this shit is coming. Oh, what the fuck is that? Run, nigga. Do the dash. You shouldn't have been in there anyway, but run, nigga. Keep running. You don't look back. You keep running. Get the fuck up out of there. Get the fuck up out of there. Don't look back. You keep running. And he gonna look back. He gonna look fucking... What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Don't look back. What'd he do? Look back. It's every time. I've been giving these niggas the source. They just don't listen. You just, first of all, first of all, this nigga just ran from whatever he saw, right? He ran from whatever he saw. Stops, turns around, and goes, again, is somebody there? I want to punch you in the face. I want to punch this nigga in the face. Because why would you do that? Why would you do that? You said go back. Nukes top five, they always replay it. They always replay it. You know what I'm saying? They always going to replay it and show you if you missed it. So don't even worry about that. Boy, fuck no, boy. Fuck no. And at night, too? <laughs> oh, you see it? Oh, there was two! For instance, what appears to be a tree branch can be seen moving bizarrely on its own. And shortly after, the man spots two translucent it was things two. walking out of the dark forest. Nah, bro. One large figure and one small. Nah, bro. 
Now, some people in Fourth Wall's comment section suspect that the man might be looking for someone inside the infamous Aoki Gihara forest. The same forest where many Japanese men and women take their own lives. Oh, that's the forest Logan Paul went to. That's the, that's the forest Logan Paul went to. But what do you think? You can watch many more it's creepy not. videos of strange ghostly sightings over on the YouTube channel, Fourth Wall. Viewer videos. Nuke's top five viewer Rocky reached out to me about a video his sister took at their family home in South Florida. Okay. Rocky claims that their home. Why it always gotta be Florida? The family has witnessed their TV turning on by itself, glasses suddenly breaking, and the voice of an older man coming from somewhere inside their house. Even stranger, Rocky claims that they have seen glimpses of strange shadow figures throughout the house. Rocky says that their home is in a bit of a bad neighborhood where many horrible crimes have taken place. He says that he wonders if their home could have been the site of some tragic event that caused the haunting. One day Rocky's sister Jay believes she saw yet another shadow figure in the bathroom of their house and begins to record with her phone. What she captures is truly bizarre. Truly bizarre. Did y'all see that? What the fuck was that? Y'all saw that? Am I tripping? <laughs> Did you see it? The As fuck Jay was is playfully switching back and forth between her phone's selfie and front camera, she catches what appears to be a very strange shadow right behind her brother. Now, when analyzing this footage, it should be noted that Rocky is holding a large cup in his right hand, virtually eliminating the possibility that this strange shadow might be his own arm. At the speed that the shadow flies upwards, it seems very unlikely that Rocky would be throwing his beverage up like that. There's also nothing behind Rocky that could explain the sudden appearance and disappearance of the shadow. There's only a teddy bear. So just what is this? Oh, fuck, listen. Fuck no, baby. This next creepy video was sent in to me by a Nukes Top 5 viewer who has a family member who works at the Huntington County Historical Museum in Indiana. The Huntington Museum is home to a collection of Indiana historical artifacts and sits right next to the Old Town Railroad track. And to me, I'm just saying, Ancient historical artifacts plus building near creepy old railroad equals it's it's probably haunted. But let's take a closer look. One day when the museum is closed and empty, the security camera motion detector is triggered by something. When the staff checks the footage, they are shocked by what they find. Oh boy, what the fuck is that? Boy, what the fuck is that? A dark mass can be seen darting towards the staircase in the back and then quickly disappearing back into the darkness. Now, the shit was invisible. Say that this is simply a digital glitch and that this figure is maybe just a person moving too quickly for the camera. Oh, okay. It's me, ghost. It's me, demon. Like, nigga, uh, <laughs> I'm good to pick up clearly. However, note that at the exact same moment, a car passes by the glass door nearby, and the car can be seen in pretty crisp detail. But as for the dark mass, there are no visual details at all. It's just an odd, shapeless black mist. Even creepier, the shadow figure is very small, about the size of a young child. But what do you think? Is the Huntington Museum haunted? You decide. Oh, no, Good friends Jay and Gino are hanging out, having a few drinks at Jay's home in England. Then this happens. What the fuck? 
What the fuck? What the fuck was that? What the fuck? Did you see that? This happens. Oh, fuck no. Jay's CCTV camera captures the moment when one of the glasses sitting on the table mysteriously shatters into pieces. Now Jay has no explanation for this creepy event, but a few days later, and things just get weirder. Again? Yeah, Ain't no way, bro. Again? Sideways. Nigga goes, Simba, what's that behind me? Nigga, there's a green screen. The video is behind me. Cut it out. <laughs> Cut it out. There's wall. It's wall. It's, there's nothing. Come on. <laughs> this time, the two friends both witness another glass explode on the table right in front of them. Jay explained in his email that he's experienced a few other strange things, but nothing worth a concern. Now... Honestly, I'm not exactly sure what's causing Jay's glasses to just randomly explode. Is it paranormal? Or does the glassware manufacturer just need to do a product recall Price on Jay's point. shitty just glasses? Get rid of all your glass you stuff. decide. Oh god. After school. Hey, thank you for the uh, paranormal 100 bitties. investigator Crisel Luna gets the unique chance to investigate a very old public school in Mexico that is said to be haunted. Now, most allegedly haunted locations that I talk about on this channel have long been abandoned or deserted. But this particular school is still in use. What? In fact, the old school building is only temporarily shut down because of the current health situation around the world. So shortly after her arrival, Crisel interviews a woman named Isabel who has worked as a cleaner and caretaker at the school for many years. Isabel claims to have seen bizarre shadows walking the school hallways and has heard strange unexplained noises throughout the building. She explains that the school was founded by a teacher named Magana, a man who lost his life inside one of the school's classrooms. What? Locals say that they see his ghost walking the school grounds very often at around 5 in the afternoon, and it is said that he picks up chairs and smashes them against the floor in anger. Crisel is joined by her friend Melissa as they start their investigation inside the classroom where the teacher Magana is said to have passed away. When Crisel asks for a sign, things take a very bizarre turn. Y con todo respeto a mí me gustaría pedirle, de verdad con todo respeto a su energía por todo lo que se dice, porque se dice que él habita aquí, porque se dice que todavía lo ven aquí, que todavía él avienta cosas con mucho enojo, como nos contaba la señora Isabel, ¿por qué no lo sabemos? Pero sí, de verdad, a mí me gustaría pedir algo, una manera. What we don't do is go, is this in Spanish? Yeah, I got the little captions though. But listen, what we don't do is go up in they house, asking for them for a sign. Because now you finna get punched in the face by a ghost. How you die and still want to be a teacher? <laughs> Nah, that's facts though. Oh god, how you die still what <laughs> Hey nah that's facts. How you die still wanna be a teacher for real, bro? Oh my god. Manifestación de su energía. Si es que él estuviera aquí, de verdad, sé que estoy jugando tal vez con fuego, pero nadie entra aquí de noche y yo estoy haciéndolo hoy porque quiero saber. Ay, ahí se escucha algo. Oh hell no. One of the classroom's desk suddenly begins to move on its own. 
Could it be that the ghost of Teacher Maganya is moving it? I don't give a goddamn about trying to pick it up and throw it to the floor? Either way, the movement is very slight. After this scary experience, Cristel and Melissa head over to investigate a different classroom inside the old school building that they believe is haunted by the child ghosts of former students. And this is when things start to get really creepy. Puedo sentir mucho más frío, de verdad se los digo, mucho más frío que en el otro salón que es donde murió el profesor. Se siente helado y no sé por qué, muchísimo más baja la temperatura aquí. Y, y ¿sabes qué? ¿Qué pienso, Melissa? De verdad es como si aquí eh, hubiera niños, no sé, el alma de un niño o de varios niños, porque tal vez uno de ellos o varios que vinieron porque es una escuela muy vieja ya perdieron la vida y puede ser también que ellos eh, vengan aquí por ay no me inventé se movió oh, hell no. No. se movió este libro ay no manches hijo se acaba de mover no me inventé vente aquí vente no hay que tocarlo a school book moves on its own giving both Priscel and Melissa a bit of a fright but they continue their investigation I'm not continuing shit when they find the school library they also find something Terrifying. Vamos a entrar. Este parece que es como una biblioteca. ¿Será Meli? Una biblioteca. Parece ser una biblioteca. Vean como hay eh, poquitos libros. Tampoco son muchos. Estamos hablando. Ahí hay algunos más que están arrumbados. Pero mm, es una escuela. Miren, ahí se ve la luz prendida de la oficina que les decía justamente a la que no podemos pasar, ¿no? Pero eh, vamos a. ¡Ah! Oh shit, you saw it? Se vio algo, se vio algo. Ay, Dios mío, no. No, a ver, no podemos salir por aquí. A ver, a ver, no, no se puede. A ver, a ver, espérate, corre. Oh no, so ya soy. Híjole, de verdad. No, yo no puedo, yo no puedo. Alguien está aquí. Alguien está aquí. Ay, no se me puede. Dios mío, Dios mío, Dios mío. Giselle and Melissa are shocked when they see a dark figure walking the hallway right outside of the library. Fuck no! But when they look into the hall, there's no one there. Hell no! The mysterious shadow figure has just disappeared into thin air. So is the old school haunted by the restless spirit of teacher Maganya? And could the ghosts of former students I'm be haunting good. the empty classrooms? Listen, I'm good anything. off that chat. You can watch this entire investigation and many more creepy videos over on the YouTube channel, Crisel Luna. Thanks for watching. Follow I'm me on good Instagram off that here, chat. Twitter here. Or hey, look at that. It's a TikTok. Eh. Anyway, hopefully I'll see you next week. I'm good off that chat. I'm good off that chat. Good off that chat. Listen. Chat, listen. 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 Fuck no, baby. I'ma take me a bubble bath. <laughs> hey, listen, man. Me and the YouTube, me and the Twitch chat, we up out of here. Y'all say bye to YouTube. Listen, YouTube. Stop investigating. Don't go in the droids. I can't. I can't. I can You know what I'm saying? But we up out of here, man. I hope you guys enjoy. Show some love to the video. Um, If you ever want to catch Terror Tuesday Live, come over to the Twitch. But with that being said, we up out of here, man. Y'all have yourselves a good one, okay? Big pieces, big pieces.